Hi, this is Nissan presenting Maria Luisa Pineda versus Virginia Zuniega de Vega, docketed in GR number 233774, decided on April 10, 2019. Facts of the case. Petitioner filed a complaint against respondent that, on March 25, 2003, respondent borrowed from her 500,000 payable within one year with an interest rate of 8% per month. To secure the loan, Respondent executed a real estate mortgage over a parcel of land together with all the buildings and improvements existing thereon in petitioner's favor. On the loan's maturity, respondent failed to pay her loan despite demand. Respondent denied petitioner's material allegations that count and countered that the complaint was dismissible for lack of prior barangay conciliation proceeding and for failure to join her husband as a party. She also argued that the interest rate agreed upon was excessive and unconscionable, thus illegal. She further denied receiving 500000 from petitioner and claimed that the said amount was the accumulated amount of another obligation she earlier secured from petitioner. Issue Whether or not there was a demand letter sent by petitioner to respondent and was it received by the latter. Ruling while delay on the part of respondent was not triggered by an extrajudicial demand because petitioner had failed to establish receipt of her demand letter, this delay was triggered when petitioner judicially demanded the payment of respondent's loan from petitioner. While the Court of Appeals was correct in observing that default generally begins from the moment the creditor demands the performance of the obligation, and without such demand, judicial or extrajudicial, the effects of default will not arise, it failed to acknowledge that when petitioner filed her complaint dated on June 10, 2005, such filing constituted the judicial demand upon respondent to pay the latter's principal obligation and the interest thereon. Respondent, having thus incurred in delay, counted from the filing of the complaint is liable for damages pursuant to Article 1170 of the Civil Code.